How to make homemade Thanksgiving stuffing. The bird may be the star of the Thanksgiving feast, but a moist, delicious stuffing will steal the turkey day spotlight every time. Here's how to make yours from scratch. You will need a one pound French bread loaf or cornbread loaf, one stick of unsalted butter, three cups of diced onions, one garlic clove, minced, six celery stalks, diced, a third cup of chopped fresh parsley, one teaspoon of dried sage, one teaspoon of dried rosemary, a half teaspoon of dried thyme, a quarter teaspoon of salt, a quarter teaspoon of black pepper, and two cups of hot turkey or vegetable stock. Equipment, a large glass baking dish, and aluminum foil. Optional, one and a half cups of peeled and chopped tart green apples, and an eight ounce jar of peeled cooked chestnuts, chopped. If you're stuffing a turkey, make the stuffing at the last minute so it can go into the bird warm, reducing the potential for bacteria to grow around it during baking. Step one, preheat the oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. Cut the bread into one half inch cubes. Spread it on two cookie sheets and toast it for 15 minutes, turning the sheets once. Step two, in a large heavy skillet, melt butter over medium heat. Stir in the onions, garlic, and celery. Cover and cook for 20 minutes, stirring occasionally. Transfer to a large bowl. Step three, mix the contents of the skillet with the bread, parsley, sage, rosemary, thyme, salt, and pepper. Stir in one and a half cups of hot turkey or vegetable stock. Then, stir in the apples or chestnuts or both if using. If you're stuffing your turkey, stuff all cavities now and put the turkey in the oven. Step four, if you have remaining stuffing or are not stuffing your turkey, reduce the oven heat to 350 degrees. Butter a large glass baking dish. Transfer the stuffing to the dish and pour a quarter to a half cup of hot stock over the top. Step five, cover the dish with aluminum foil and bake for about 30 minutes. Uncover and bake an additional five to 10 minutes for a crispy golden top. Did you know? Sarah Josepha Hale, who campaigned in the 1860s to make Thanksgiving a national holiday, was also the author of the nursery rhyme, Mary Had a Little Lamb.